How do we make metal surfaces stronger, harder, and more wear resistant? The answer is laser cladding. This cutting edge process uses lasers to fuse materials with precision, creating strong metallurgical bonds with minimal distortion. Dr. Alain Kusmoko, a researcher from the University of Wollongong, investigates how Stellite 6 lasers coatings can improve the durability of 1050 steel. Unlike traditional methods, lasers offer better heat control and allow for targeted material deposition. When the laser strikes the surface, it melts the material, forming a melt pool, a liquid region where the base steel mixes with the coating powder. The size of this melt pool determines how much of the steel mixes with the Stellite 6. A smaller melt pool reduces dilution, while a larger melt pool increases it, altering the coating's properties. In this study, Dr. Kusmoko explored how varying laser power levels, 1 kilowatt and 1.8 kilowatts, affects coating quality, focusing on dilution, carbon content, and wear resistance. Dr. Kosmoko's research revealed that at 1 kilowatt, the coating had 40% less dilution, higher carbon content of 0.982%, and greater hardness of 600 HV compared to 500 HV at 1.8 kilowatts. Lower dilution at 1 kilowatt retained more carbon, promoting the formation of CR7C3 carbide particles, which hardened the coating and significantly improved wear resistance. Wear tests further show that the coating at 1 kilowatt had 40% less mass loss compared to 1.8 kilowatts, making it more durable. This is due to the finer microstructure, higher hardness, and better carbon retention achieved with a smaller melt pool. This breakthrough has significant implications for industries like aerospace, mining, and automotive. By using 1 kilowatt laser power, we can produce coatings that are stronger, harder, and longer lasting, reducing maintenance costs and increasing operational efficiency. Want to learn more? Check out Dr. Kosmoko's full research on laser cladding and its impact on wear-resistant materials. Visit the link to explore the future of durable coatings.